guys to come in their apartment. Okay. Come, come up and meet them. Okay. Come up and meet them. Ah, so move. <laughs> We are now in the Akadayo branch in the Akwayaboom State, in Ubium local government area. These are some of the descendants of the founding pioneer members, and some of these members have actually been baptized in the March 1979 time. We have Bishop Akpadia standing next to uh, President Maybe, his wife, and other dignitaries, and some bishops and counselors and this is a wonderful day for us to be here. The walk to the river at Ikat Eo where the first baptisms were performed. This is the end as we proceed down to where the commemorative monument is. Now we are at the spot where this occurred. We can see some washing being done. And these are the great saints here in the monument. Let me join this picture because I miss the other. Please, please, please. These are wonderful pioneers and saints. Uh, picture and commemorating this great event and this is the, the place and this is just a little longer picture here and it looks like we've got some lookers on here take okay And here we are back to the saints. Aren't these beautiful saints? Oh, yes. One side we got this great portrait of this handsome couple oh, yes. here. <laughs> this is the bishop and his wife and grandson. Hey, wonderful, yes. This young man has every one of his toes, but he's <laughs> got to be really careful. This beautiful <laughs> gown was made in the bishop's home by his dear wife. And uh, you can just see what a gorgeous gown it is. And she says that this uh, border around her neck she did on her machine. She of course had to wait until the electricity was on, but then she was able. Here in the farm we have um, cassava. It's cassava, and we have cuckoo yam here. Then you have pumpkin leaf. Pumpkin leaf. These are the things we plant in the farm. Three items. Sugar again. Okay. We still have sugar again over there. This farm is meant to sustain the members. We encourage them to use their hands to work so that at the end of the day, they can have something to sustain themselves. Very impressive. That is the main aim of the farm. Instead of our members staying idle and maybe waiting for Makara <laughs> <laughs> to bring something to them yeah. so they can work in the farm and sustain themselves. What is Makara? Makara is you. White man. Oh. <laughs> Instead of waiting for white man to bring so they can use their hands and walk. I see. So this is the main purpose. We have so many farms in so many locations. We have taken so many of the purpose too, like the Crowder. 
as a Western witness. But if you don't want to walk, you cannot read where you don't see. So those who endeavor to walk here have their own portion during harvest. Of their family maintenance. Do they have their own section or are they just of course, work anywhere? Yes, in the Pika farms we have a section created for the ward. Pass of income. Then we have a separate section kept for the family members. So the other section meant for the ward goes straight to the pass offering fund, which is general. Then the other portion is for each individual family. And they, they, we encourage them also to pay their tithing through those.